hey everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you all are doing well so today i'm going to fix this motherboard and uh, this is a hp probook x360 g2 laptop motherboard and this motherboard condition is uh, it's not turning on let me show the problem so when i connect this power supply to this uh, motherboard and it's not turning on just charging white leds blinking only as you can see when i press the power button also it's not turning on only white led is blinking so now i will try to fix this motherboard so let's try to fix it uh, okay as you can see this is the motherboard model number 6050829081001 so let me show again you just connect this power supply and as you can see it's not turning on it's stuck only 0 0.10 something so if i press this power button as you can see here it's not turning on it's not taking any ampere only white led is blinking so now i will check step by step all the required voltage and try to fix this motherboard so first thing first I need to open this heat sink so it's open and now I connect my power supply again and I will check some required voltage like uh, 3 volt 5 volt alloys ball always is present three volt always also present it should be 1.8 yes 1.8 also present it's okay this is a CPU core section this is a RAM supply so after uh, turning on this laptop after uh, press the power button if uh, this motherboard is turning on then this voltage will available here so this should be one volt okay this also may be suspension voltage uh, after uh, press that, uh, turning on this motherboard then uh, we can get this voltage here so now i will check adid signal see the center pin here okay as you can see this is 18.31 this is abnormal because uh, this voltage should be 2.5 or 3 volt 2.5 3 or 1 something because uh, i don't have this uh, schematic or board view so i can i cannot confirm how many voltages we can get here so now i will check this line under my microscope This is 19 volt. It's showing 18.31. And okay. What is this here? So if you look carefully, little bit track here. So. I don't know how this happened here. Okay. Okay, and here is a 19 volt. Here is nothing. So I guess this here D6035. Okay. This part is not necessary here or this parts is not available 
so now I will check another donor board I have already another board so I will check continuity from here to here so I set my multimeter in beep mode and let's check here and here okay as you can hear no beeping that means this line is broken here so now we'll check another board hmm? okay this is another motherboard so now i'll check this motherboard because i don't have any schematic or board view so as you can see here no cracking here so i just touch here and touch here so it's beeping that means see that means uh, this line this line is coming here so now i will make a jumper here to here Okay, jumpering is done. Now we'll check this problem is solved or not. So let me check. Let's connect the power supply. Okay, as you can see, it's turning on. It's turning on. So if I check here again, it's 2.5 it's 2.5 now before it was 18 volt now it's 2.5 so this problem happened for this little crack crack here so this crack can dead this entire laptop so now we'll check the display Magic. So this is the display. Connect to the DS. Connect power supply again. It's uh, turning on. We have to wait for a few seconds. Okay, we have the HP logo. So it's done. So if you want to support my channel, so please hit the subscribe button, press the bell icon. If you already subscribed my channel, thank you so much. Thanks for watching.